Um, you know, one of the things, you know, everybody's been talking about since WrestleMania is, is like, should he have won? And, um, you know, every, you know, there's a lot of people really unhappy that he didn't win. And, you know, the, the, the answer to the question, because I always get asked, what do you think now? And it's kind of like, well, it doesn't matter because it's like the answer to the question is going to be like six months or a year from now or whatever, you know, whenever the story plays out. And then we will see if they, you know, told a better story, Mr. Peak, whatever. It'll be easier to judge then than now. But I did want to say something, and and it's it's, it's and a couple of people have brought this up, and it's actually Dustin who said it today, and Paul Heyman who said it, and it was just like, well, once he wins, what's left for him? And it's a nice thing to say, but then I started thinking about it, and it was like, okay, if Cody would have won, what's left for him? And it's like, he'd be defending the title against Brock Lesnar in this pay-per-view. I mean, yeah, I I heard the same thing. Like, you know, what does he do if he wins? And then, you know, they did that angle with Brock. And it's it's like, like, well, that's what they would do if he would have won. And then, you know, the same question, like, you know, but it's like it's it's like well, here's the thing. Okay, it's like if he wins, okay, if he wins, what what's he gonna do? And it's like, okay, he can defend against Brock Lesnar. He can defend against Bobby Lashley. He can defend against Roman Reigns. He can defend against Solo Sokoa. He can defend against Sami Zayn if he needs to do that. He can defend against Drew McIntyre. He can defend against Gunther. And I think I've just run down about 18 months of shit that he could do. Okay? So it's like he has got plenty that he can do. I mean, and I haven't even, and I, and I, I there's, there's several other names that I could bring up as well. So it's like he's got so much stuff. And if Roman is champion, What's, what can Roman do? Roman's going to not wrestle much. And can he defend against Lesnar? No, because of stipulation. He can't wrestle Lesnar anymore. Who can he wrestle against? He can, they can turn Solo Sokoa. Yes. They can have him do Cody Rhodes one more time. Um, they could do Sami Zayn, but everyone knows that Sami Zayn isn't going to win. Um, or Drew McIntyre, which is already a... Um, which in the case of Roman Reigns is someone he's already beaten. Um, it's not a new match or anything like that. Essentially, there's probably about four times as many things that Cody can do. Plus, he's going to be there more um, than well, Roman Reigns could do. It's not even just four times as many things. But it's also, yeah, you, you, you name some things that Roman could do. There are also things we've already seen. So if you want to talk about, like, what new things would we see with Roman as champ... Well, there's nothing so, unless they so, turn so, Solo so, Sokoa so, or so, Jey Uso. Solo Sokoa and Jey Uso. That's but literally Cody, it. But, but with Cody, Cody, could re- Cody could wrestle both of them. Yeah, with Cody as champion, I mean, there's there's countless new things that he could do that we haven't seen before. So yes, I did hear that like right after WrestleMania when Paul Heyman made that comment about you know, and, and fans had said it as well that that were advocates of Roman winning. It was kind of like. There's plenty of things that the guy can do if he wins. There's plenty of feuds. There's plenty of storylines. And it was the it's, same thing, actually, with... It's, um, it's, it's, it's almost... Well, hold on. Like, it's the same thing with, with when we were arguing about should MGF turn babyface. And everybody's like, oh, well, who's he going to wrestle as a babyface? And then I had this long freaking list. Well, yeah, there's a long too. list. And then when you, when you, when when you make the him. list for that or Cody, you're also not taking into account that you can actually turn people because it's fake. So you could have turned babyface's heels, which, in fact, they have done with the Blackpool Combat Club. And you can turn, you know, babyface's heels if you need them for Cody. There's plenty but, the guy could but, do as champion. Loading up on some liquid energy here. Uncle Howdy. Why does he do this? Why does he do this? That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. Why does he do that? Me to explain Uncle Howdy. Yes. Somebody needs to put that to music, some 70s song, for the best of the Brian and Vinny show. Yeah, keep it off this show, please. Why does he do this? Why does he do this? That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. We're going to get kicked off whatever run. You just disgusted Granny. That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. What a jamming song that is. 
Yeah, keep it off this show, please. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, The Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.